How's it good everyone? Basically, if you haven't really been keeping up, uh, there have been a lot of updates to Plutonium Black Ops 2. I'm just gonna get through them quick instead of wasting your time. Basically, I mean, first of all, they added custom emblems. You may have already seen this, but they haven't tweeted about it until recently, which is kind of odd. But you cannot make your own emblem. Pretty sure they reset them. They did a little, like, profile reset recently to, like, accommodate for a new update, which I'll mention in a bit. But basically, that also means that your custom emblems you may have, you may have made before the huge update, it's probably gone. I also have to unlock all again, but that's not a big deal. They did also reset your classes. As you can see, this is all just pure purely default. I'm actually gonna make a new class real quick. All right, done. You can also not add friends on the main menu. I don't have any friends who play plutonium but if you do have anyone added then they'd appear right here on this menu you can see what they're doing you can see their rank you can also now invite them to a private match which i guess i'll get into that now you can now do private matches you can now make standard lobby private matches just like you used to it uses original like black ops 2 networking code only with the extra plutonium features but yeah you can add friends and you can invite them to to these private matches and for the most part this is the absolute main thing that they added i'm gonna have some bots real quick Actually, no, I'm not. But basically, now, if you want to invite friends to a private match, you don't have to host a separate server anymore. You can just invite them. No, we're just fine. But we're going to join a server real quick. You may have also noticed that Plutonium has just been overall growing in popularity, like, by a lot. This is because a ton of streamers have been playing it. You, you may remember the uh, mod huge Modern for 3 tournament with the Spanish streamers, which I actually made a whole video about. But it goes even beyond that. You know, streamers like Aiden Ross making multiple streams about just playing the game normally, playing wagers, etc. Which, I mean, I, I love to see that. Plutonium is definitely one of the coolest things to come out recently. The, the mod, not the... <laughs> come on. Oh, no cross map, really. I have been making a lot more search and destroy videos recently. I might j actually have to do like a search and destroy gameplay tomorrow. I'm getting annihilated, what the hell? I've got the head glitch, you have no chance. Excuse me. Should I lower my sense? Might have to try that, honestly. Why is it on nine? No, seven, seven, seven. Come on. Actually, no, I make that six. Why was it so high? I, <laughs> I think I was trying to snipe at one point. I, I, I don't know, man. Only like 4 and 19. Wow, this is an awful game. I should just end the video. What's that guy doing? Is he going for a trick shot? I'm not expected. Nah, alright. Uh, yeah, those are the latest plutonium updates. Thank you for all the support on the, on the last plutonium video. Got like 500 views. I did not expect that. I expected like 80 at most. Especially since the video isn't even really that good, to be honest. That no audio. I was like desperately trying to mumble through it. Trying to like come up with things on the spot. It was it was a rough video, man. But, but thank you for the support. Thanks for watching.